Okay, guys, let's talk about the UOB Preferred Platinum Visa Credit Card. Alright, so, okay, it's a normal looking card. If you like blue, ah, you can try to get it, right? <laughs> you say that, you know, it looks so unglam. <laughs> that it looks like a debit card. Of course, like, you know, uh, it's boring, but it can let you earn up to four miles per one dollar, alright? Okay, so let's take a look deeper into it. So, uh, okay, you can exchange the full rewards for gifts and voucher in UOB Rewards Catalog, and of course you can, uh, you know, exchange them for air miles to cash back. Alright, so, uh, the uni dollar, okay, uni dollar is a little bit, uh, uh, screwed up, uh, later I will explain how do you actually, you know, uh, what is the conversion rate for the uni dollar. So, the annual fee itself is actually $196.60, $2 more expensive than most of the credit cards. Um, first year waiver, and then sub card will be quite expensive, eh? very speaking, $96. The other cards are like at $53. Uh, so you're going to get sub card, right? Don't get bother getting this. Uh, interest rate period 21 days. Well, uh, I think there are some with like 25 days. So you are a prompt payer, well, this won't matter you much. Late fee at $100, money minimum at 3%. Uh, foreign currency fee is a 3.25%, uh, like I said, no, not very voila for this. Advance, the cash advance, bloody expensive. This 8%, the other one is 6%. Right? Over limit at $40. Uh, well, Singaporeans are getting at $30,000 and non-Singaporean $40,000 a year that you can get this credit card. Uh, well, they're using Visa. So, over here. So if the base reward right is that uh, for every uh, one unit dollar is equal to equivalent to five dollar. All right. So this is the extra benefit. So the bonus rewards point is at nine dollar. They give you for every five dollar spent on shopping, uh, entertainment, or mobile contactless. Right. You get additional uh, bonus spending in this category. It's actually quite quite a bit, right? So uh, bonus, but however bonus right, uh, is actually cap at $2,000 uni a month. Okay, so uh, according to a TNC, alright, so uh, to gain the reward points, uh, excluding net transactions, top up cash value, la, wire transfer remittance, utilities, insurance, financial FIs are quite straightforward. Security brokers, dealer, uh, dealers also. Parking, gambling, hospital, school, charitable, court bail, Fine taxes, uh, most services, and government services, all excluded from the rewards points. So, how do you plan to uh, uh, maximize? Since uh, you can only earn a maximum of $2,000 unit dollar per month, so that means you can only uh, do $1,100 uh, worth of spending. Alright, so any more waste time. So, so if you look at it, right, um, one unit dollar is equal to $5, that's the basic uh, earn rate. So that means uh, uh, here is 2.2 or point, uh, 0.2 to 0.4 miles per $1 spent. That means 0.4 miles per $1 spent, which is actually quite low. Eh? All right? uh, but of course, with the bonus, it's actually 4 miles to $1, which actually uh, this is a uh, good one. But of course, uh, anything less than 2,000, then don't bother. Yeah, uh, more than 2,000, uh, then don't bother. So, uh, yeah, so bonus category is the one. So, uh, this card is actually good if you are uh, planning to spend about 1,110 of a spending. Then worth we'll getting it because otherwise you can't. Um, uh, similar perks like with HSBC. Yeah, so later I'll cover HSBC revolution also. So should we get it? Very speaking, we short, uh, short online quite a bit, it's fine. But then, like I said, upper limit at two, uh, 1,000 plus, uh, you know, 1,001 a month, which is actually pretty easily hit lah. so then don't bother with it and also to note lah, that UOB mouse expires within two years so uh, remember to convert your mouse and then convert to the uh, crisp flyer so that you can actually uh, fly quite often so first to new UOB first hundred you get a uh, uh, additional cashback of $150 you will spend 1005 within 30 days so competitors wise later I will cover the rest Right. So alternative, well, DBS, Women's Card, OCBC, Titanium Card, HFCC Re uh, Revolution. So frankly speaking, UOB uh, wise, I would say this is decent. But then frankly speaking, if you spend more than one thousand one, 
hundred a month then don't bother yeah because uh, then the bonus mouse base mouse are actually very weak so uh, pretty uh, not very awesome card so but then good to earn four mouse per one dollar right so if you are interested to get that and then spend uh, re-strategize your spending then this might be pretty useful all right any other cards you want to be looking at do feel free to ping me and i will uh, and review the credit card and of course give you my honest feedback and how will i strategize to get free months what right, see ya